Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome to another boss guide for Lies of P. I want to say a big thank you to everybody that's been watching these guides. Um, the response has been fantastic. People just getting helped everywhere, which makes me feel really good. This one is... Oh, God. Okay, this, this is going to be a big one for people. This is going to be one that gets a lot of people stuck. And I know we said that on the last guide, but yeah, this, this one... Who oh boy. It's a gank fight. Uh, I'm going to turn on my Monad lamp real quick, just for extra brightness. So this is a gank fight. A lot of tips to go over with this one. Basically how it works is you've got one big guy who's like the main boss. Um, if, you, if you kill him, I think you just win. But then he's got his three other uh, brothers. Are they all brothers? One sounds feminine or looks feminine. I don't know. Whatever. Anyways, he's got his three siblings that'll pop into the fight. And basically, you have to take them out or you'll be, you know, you'll be um, overwhelmed. So the goal of this fight is to basically perfect guard the big bro until his weapon breaks or ideally, you know, his weapon breaks at some point in the fight so that he deals significantly reduced damage and then go for backstabs on the siblings to get them out because they'll do these big crazy attacks, but they'll open themselves up to backstabs at which point you can, you know deal big damage. Uh, you can also just kill them, of course. You can just fight them when you get the chance, but yeah. Fable arts are huge as well. The blue bars in the top left corner of your screen. Um, also, our build is going to be a plus two Holy Sword of the Ark, which is a boss weapon. Uh, Full Menace, which we never use. At least I don't use it. Nameless One's Amulet, Carrier's Amulet, Patient's Amulet, and then here is my... Uh, uh, defensive options here, which again, probably doesn't matter all that much. We got five heals. We got the fire, um, the fire grinder, which we'll probably wait to use to finish him off. And yeah, let's go. Wish me luck. Cause this is a doozy man. So this guy's just going to come at you and start swinging out of the gate. And we're just going to try to perfect guard, perfect guard attack. Okay. What else you got? Perfect guard, perfect guard. Perfect guard. And perfect guard. Beautiful. You see his weapon glows red. Perfect guard. His weapon glows red, uh, which shows you that it's degrading. Perfect guard. Perfect guard. Okay, we're going to attack him here. Guard. We're just going to guard this attack here, which unfortunately deals weapon durability damage to ourselves. All right, first guy's coming in. So we are going to run away, target this guy. We're going to look for an opportunity to backstab him, like right here. Beautiful. Fantastic. Now we're going to charge up an R2, deal more damage, and then try... Okay, also, the big bro will charge you. Uh, very important to watch out when he does that. Okay, can we finish him here? It's just that easy, folks. It is just that easy, folks. And then he should get out of the fight now. Uh, we're going to heal. What else is? What else does he have? Okay. Uh, 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 uh. We're going to attack here. Guard. Guard. Guard, guard, and go oh, I went for the charge R2. Oh, guard, okay. Let's try to get him here. Oh, missed it. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Guard, guard. Oh, his weapon just broke. Yeah, so huge. Huge, huge, huge. So now he deals way less damage. So yeah, if you perfect guard, he will break his weapon. Uh, also, we got lucky with the amulet that doesn't consume charges. Okay, I also don't know when these guys come in. Like, sometimes it seems health-based. Other times it seems, like, just timing-based. So the second guy is easy. He's just got a spear. Uh, we're going to try to bait out attacks and try to get some um, backstabs on him here. Let's see if we can. Yeah, this guy's kind of ruining that, though. All right, let's get out of the way here. Heal up real quick. Make sure to stay locked on to the correct target. Oh, this guy's ruining everything. So welcome to gank fights, if you haven't done those in, in the past. Okay, you can also break their weapons, because their weapons glow as well, I believe. Okay, this is, yeah, this is really awkward. What happened to the other guy? Oh, he's just chilling. All right. All right, let's, yeah, this is super duper duper awkward. Uh, we're going to heal. Could have gotten a backstab right there, but yeah, this is a very awkward scenario. So let's try to bait out an attack. Okay. Almost got the backstab there. Yeah, super duper awkward. Okay, there's the backstab. Alright, we're going to charge up an R2 as he's getting up here. Unfortunately, we miss. Okay, that is fine. 
Yeah, you can see how good the breaking of the weapon is. Okay, try to go for a backstab here. We miss, but he should be out of the fight soon here. So we're just going to go a little aggressive. Okay. All right, now... Now we want to use this time to grind our weapon. So we're going to bait out an attack from this guy. Can you attack? What the heck? Yeah, this is like... I feel like this fight is on hard mode right now. Okay, because I'm getting stuck on everything, but... Anyways, we're going to grind up our weapon here, try to get back to maximum uh, durability. Okay, and there it is. Ah! Okay. And then we've got the last one here. So we're going to use our Fable attacks on this guy. We're also going to heal so we can start... So we can start, um... Oh yeah, there we go. So we can start, uh, recovering an extra heal. We're also gonna use this to make our weapon flames. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright. Now we gotta try to go for... Oh, this guy's got a grappling hook. I didn't even know that. Okay. Perfect guard there. Nice. Hello? What is happening? My encoding? Encoding just decided to die there. Got the backstab. Beautiful. Charging R2 as he gets up. Excellent. All right, he's close. He is close. You probably want a Fable attack here. We're gonna go for a Fable attack. Nice. All right. And we're gonna heal here, so we start getting an extra heal. And now we just got the big boy. And we're just gonna perfect block when we can. Go ham, get an extra heal. Block, block, block. Attack, block. Should not have attacked there, but that's fine. Okay, this one you can just strafe. Unfortunately, missed the charged R2 there. Strafe, charged R2. You want his health bar to be white. There it is. We're going to charge an R2 here, see if we can get him. Ugh, out of range always with that R2. All right, I want to use our Fable attack here. So the Fable attack on this one, two, three. Yeah, what is happening in my encoding, man? All right, we can charge it up to three times, and we get, like, super armor, basically. Okay, we got to be very careful here. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, charge R2. Got him. Gonna stagger him. And that is how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, so lots of stuff to, uh, lots of stuff to digest here. Wish I could stop the cutscene, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, I'm playing on Game Pass, so I can't really, like, go into the, uh, go into the menu and stop this cutscene, but lots of stuff to digest here. Uh, basically, it's a gank fight, but it's not nearly as hard as it seems. You want to basically do all the stuff that I just said in the guide video, of course. And, uh, yeah, it's um, definitely doable. Will I pay for that, though? Will I pay for that? I think you'll pay for that. So, yeah, uh, basically, again, you want to just guard... The Black Rabbit Society, Eliminator, whatever they're called, Resplendent, Ergo, Chunk, and Taunt Gesture, as well as about 10k Ergo. Uh, so yeah, basically, again, you want to just perfect guard until the big bro's weapon breaks, because then he deals way less damage. And then when the other little brothers come in or whatever, you want to look for opportunities to get backstabs on them, to get charged R2s on them, to get your fable arts on them, you know, whatever gets them out of the fight. But really just letting them use their attacks and getting behind them and backstabbing is the way to go. And then, you know, once you do that times three, you just got the big bro who's got a broken weapon. And yeah, you could just take him out. So hope that guide helped. If it did, we have boss guides for every other boss in this game, or at least we will be making guides for every other boss in this game. Thanks so much for watching. Support the video if you'd like, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.